so we are bu- 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 it's your boy friday ricky dread aka no lack academics um do remember to subscribe to our youtube channel hit that subscribe button right there in the corner make sure to hit the notification button as well so you know when we're dropping new videos daily and we're back with the top six tracks in toronto um that track that you heard playing in the beginning of uh of the video right there that was casino barnes done done big 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 tune um Yo, look out for Casino Barnes doing this thing, you know what I mean? And all the Toronto rappers that have been dropping music on a weekly basis, you know what I mean? Big up to y'all. Um, let's get to our top six tracks that we have. Uh, I've been looking through these internet streets, you know what I mean? You know, looking on Instagram, looking on people's uh, YouTube channels and different things like that to see new new releases that have been dropping. And we've uh, found about six tracks right now that are, are going to be hitting the list. So... With no further ado, um, let's get to the list. Oh, before before we do this, with the do, um, big up the Toronto rappers, you know what I mean, helping me um, curate the list this week. We've been conversing back and forth, like, yo, who's hot in these streets right now? You know what I mean? What what tracks are burning up the streets? And at first it was a little slow, and then all of a sudden I just started seeing tracks just flood the fucking floodgates. So big up to Toronto rappers, um, and big up to the Toronto rappers in the scene, as well as all the Canadian rappers who are doing their thing, trying to get to that fucking holy grail. So let's get to the shits right now. So, all right. So the first track on our top six list is Drama the Problem. Get the burner. Get the burner. I see you posted on the gram, holding up all of these bands, but they belong to your mans. Like, bitch, please. What you think that we don't know? That you ain't got no dope and you ain't got no hoes. Oh, uh, bitch, please. I don't know why all these people hate you because Drake don't even like you. Why you think he never took you overseas? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big video, big video, big tune. Um, apparently, he's got a few grievances that he wants to air out on that tune. So, yeah, let's see how that whole thing unfolds. Let's see if there's going to be any return fire when it comes to any tracks from the other side. You know what I'm saying? And, yeah, let's keep it music. Um, next on the list here, We Love Hip Hop Alumni, Slim De Niro, Hallelujah. Maybe got me going insane, blowing OG to the membrane. Yeah, big tune, big tune. Um, like the cinematography in there, how they're in the in the lush fields and everything like that. Big up to Slim De Niro. I look up for that Slim De Niro um, episode that we have up on our YouTube channel right now. You know what I'm saying? If uh, you subscribe, you'll be able to get your hands on that right there. Um, next on our list, Molly Swayze featuring Smiley, Bone to Pick. I can't deal with this, man. I got a bone to pick. I got a bone to pick. Wow, these niggas be talking so crazy, but my niggas known for this. I got a bone to pick. I got a bone to pick. How are you claiming you trapping so hard, but giving tough for all the tears? Jeez. Big fucking tune. I got a bone to pick. Yo, I, I like how the men them are, are flowing on the tune, you know what I mean? They're bringing a, a, a different type of vibe, um, a different type of flow, and yeah, 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 yeah. Big up to Molly Swayze and, uh, and Smiley, you know what I'm saying? Big, big, big fucking tune. It's a ting. Next on the list, another We Love Hip Hop alumni, Boogs, Flow Different. My flow different. Huh. I cut clothes different. I fuck hoes different. She can tell the difference. Ten holes, but I ain't pippin' full like Scotty Pippin'. I ain't even know I'm drippin'. Swag like partition, chef with no kitchen. You ain't got ambition. Yo, um, big up to Bugs. The very, very energetic fucking performance in the video as usual. I see him down there in Dundas Square doing his thing. You know what I mean? Yo, you should have hollered at me. I would have, you know. Walk down to Dundas Square and do my thing. You know I'm a downtown man. You know what I mean. But yeah, big up the Bugs, big big tune. And you know you got a new mixtape that is on the way, and the Father Figure on the way mixtape is out right now. So big up the Bugs, yo. Uh, next on our list, another We Love Hip Hop alumni, Huncho Hoodlum, No Hook Part Two. You dig? Ain't shit changed, man. Ain't shit changed, but the niggas. You dig? Fuck the niggas that switch up on me, man. Everyone got beef 
with me like I'm 6'9 six nine. Six nine. Little nigga standing tall like I'm 6'9 I never made broski go get the burning I stay with mine Big, 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 big tune. Um, big up to Honcho Hoodlum. I seen him doing a piece of that verse of uh, the No Hook Part 2 track that he just released on um, Keep Six Live. Yeah, big up, you know, shout out to Keep Six Live. I seen him on the YouTube channel. They had posted a video, and in the end of the video, he started doing a little bit of a freestyle, and that's the a part of the verse that I hear that's on the track right here. So it's good to hear it on a beat, you know what I mean? And I, and I like to see Hancho Hoodlum back with some more music. So big up to you, Hancho Hoodlum. Last but not least on this list, and do remember, what am I smoking right here? I don't even know what the fuck I'm smoking, but do remember, you guys get to pick who gets to be number one on this list. So we need y'all to come out strong, the, you know, comment gang strong always. And, you know, make sure to leave your comments below. Let us know who you want to be number one on the list, okay? Um, so next on the list right now, T. Grams, Juice. Uh. First things first, let me take them to church. Every day is a blessing on earth for the twerk. Get girth, put in work for the turf till a man gets murked. Put a man in the dirt and his fam got hurt, but his life goes on. Can't sleep, that's why I sleep when I write those songs. Had a Bible in my cell, I recite those songs. Hell no, I ain't perfect trying to write those wrong. Big, big tune. And the video is fucking sick, you know, directed by Rodzilla. I like how the way they mixed in the, the whole juice from the from the, the movie juice, you know, something close to my heart as a, as an old school nigga, you know what I mean? So big up to you, T. Grams. Also, we love hip hop alumni from way, way, way back over in episode, I think, three or four. So we, we, we're going to have to have T. Grams come back up on the show and, and, and talk to the to the world's most smoked out podcast. So that's the top six list that I figured out so far. I don't have 10 on the li list this week, only six. I'm not gonna make this video super duper long this week and we're gonna just cut it short and just get to the shits, you know what I mean? Um, but we need you to make sure to come and pick what will be the number one on that list. And then, you know, whatever else the rest of that order is gonna be, all right? So it's depending on you, the people. Um, artist that I feel that has been slept on, this week's slept on artist of the week, and I'm sorry I haven't been bringing this segment um, back weekly as, as usual, you know, lots of things are going on in the city, so definitely something that I want to continue, um, and y'all let me know in the comments who you think is the slept on artist, but this week's slept on artist of the week, I think is Scotty Audi, the track um, that I was looking at was called Scotty Pippen or... Niggas talking, niggas bitches, stop the talking, get the whipping, get it popping, shove the clipping, 33, I'm Scotty Pippin, wait, niggas talking, niggas bitches, stop the talking, get the whipping, 33, I'm Scotty Pippin, wait, wait, I'm on that bullshit again, I think I need me a beam on, I think the video I was looking at is, um, the track is produced by Beats So Precious, men's are represent, representing Scarborough, the video is fucking dope. The, the track has a bop and a crazy energy to it. So big up to Scotty Yachty. You know what I mean? Um, yeah, I feel that he's uh, been pretty slept on because that video in the space of about a week or so is already doing 20K. And even me personally, for making this top six list that we've been doing every week, I missed that one. So my bad to you, Scotty Yachty. And big up to you at the same time. You know what I mean? Doing big fucking things, representing the Scarborough area. You know what I'm saying? Um, I want to say something on a more somber note. Pray for Toronto. There was a major, major shooting that happened last night in the Danforth area over in um, the, about Danforth and Logan area. A 29-year-old man with, uh, who's been unidentified so far came through, started letting off shots. He let off multiple shots, about 13 shots or 15 shots. He hit 12 people in total, um, or 12 people were injured and two people died, um, as well as the gunman was killed um, on, on the scene. So, you know, our condolences to the families of the two people who passed away. And, you know, pray for all of the families who, who are of the injured. You know what I mean? You know, pray for the injured. Make sure that they get to a steady and, and speedy recovery. It's a tragic thing. It, the city is going pretty crazy. And it's not gang violence that's happened this time. This is just a random shooting. And um, it, it still speaks to the problem because it means that there's a lot of, you know, just too much fucking guns in the street, basically. And um, anything can happen anywhere. Okay, don't think that just only in the hood 
that you know mans are shooting mans are shooting just in the middle of downtown mans are shooting on, on in greek town over on danforth and you know it, it, it all speaks to a bigger problem let me know in the comments below how you feel you know also leave the hashtag pray for toronto um it's, it's a really really serious thing when you start to feel like you live in a downtown area and you don't feel as safe to just walk the streets because you know not just the gun activity that that might happen with gun violence but just anything could just pop off anywhere on some terrorist shit so yeah it's a real real thing you know what i'm saying once again pray for toronto hashtag pray for toronto um takashi 69 got fucking pistol whipped and kidnapped um there's a lot of mixed reactions. Not actually, not much mi mixed reaction. Most of the reactions is, yeah, the motherfucker had it coming. He had it coming. Yeah. Um. Basically, the test my gangster challenge has now ended. You know what I'm saying? Um, I want y'all to know that you know I love y'all. <laughs> it's getting real. He says he got kidnapped, he got pistol whipped, he feels it's an inside job. Um, you know, academics has been reporting on this gentleman for a while and, you know, making a lot of affiliation with him, showing up in his videos and different things like that. So, um, you know, just a quick message to you academics, stop hanging around with 6 9 because if man banged him out like that and ended his test my, test my gangster challenge, you don't want to be next to him when the shit really happens again, okay? Um, we've seen some a lot of uh, we've seen a lot of unfortunate incidents that's happened over the last few weeks. Can't even say months or years. The last few weeks with rappers, you know what I mean? R.I.P. to Smoke Dog, R.I.P. to XXX Ten Ten Tantian, and you know, and Jimmy Wapo, and you know, you don't want to be next to the man that's asking for the target to be on his back. Is all I'm saying, okay? Make sure to um, sign up for our Patreon, you know, become a Patreon member. You know, it's a paid service where you help the team that, you know, help us to get new equipment, you know, help us to support the cause that we have here called the We Love Hip Hop podcast, as well as the Six List and all the different shows that we produce here and bring for you here on our YouTube channel. Um, you know, we, you'll get to unlock videos that um, are exclusive that haven't been released yet. Some will be putting up videos that are not going to be getting released and only available on our Patreon and early interviews. For example, we got the Brizzle interview. Brizzle killed the freestyle. We posted that on our YouTube channel as well as uh, we have the full interview that's going to be available on the Patreon right now. So sign up for the Patreon. The first tier, you'll be able to unlock that. And we'll also give you a shout out on the World's Most Smoked Out podcast tier two. You'll be able to get um, a, 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 a live review of your EP, your mixtape, or album by the Monday on the We Love Hip Hop podcast. You know what I mean? Once you unlock tier two with the, with, with, the, with the paid service for that one. You know what I mean? And like I said, it goes back to the team. It goes back to helping us to grow this to make sure that we bring you quality, quality content all the time. You know what I'm saying? So sign up for the Patreon. Look out for the Swagger Right um, video that we have out right now, the full Swagger Right interview, uh, Swagger Right and Sean Payne. Yeah, 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 yeah. And shout out to Destiny, you know, she was our co-host for that day. Yeah, very dope interview. Got to learn a lot of things about Swagger Right. It was up on our Patreon before and now it's released, you know, free to the public up on YouTube, right? So look out for that interview. As well as the local city interview that we're gonna be posting very soon working on it right now it's going to be like a documentary slash interview so big up to local city big up to the whole bleaker projects you know what i mean we were out there representing for juice day you know what i mean r.i.p to my boy juice you know what I mean? he passed away about 11 years ago and i went over there to represent as well as to get a, a exclusive interview with local city so look out for that coming real 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 soon six list is going to be uh dropping some real we're going to be dropping some real real dope interviews on the six list real soon one with Alizé, who's a, 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 a rapper slash adult entertainment um, star. You know, she's got videos up on YouTube, you know, giving instructional things on how to, you know, for how, you know, teach women, teach women how to give head, teach the niggas how to lick pussy, you know, just doing all types of crazy things, as well as dropping dope music that's up on her YouTube channel. And she's over on, on Pornhub. So, you know, um, shout out to AJ, AKA Mr. OK, OK, you know, early morning, late nights. And, um, he got a dope interview on the six list that he did with her for um, for the six list, Alize, as well as What's with Andy, the man who did that um, Virginia Black um, that little Virginia Black skit that was up on Instagram where he was like, yeah, 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 you know, um, 
when I drink Virginia get Black, it gives me that err. You know what I mean? So yeah, real, real, real funny dude. And he has mad other skits that um, he's popular for. Real, real funny dude. You know what I mean? Early morning, late nights, got to do an exclusive interview with him as well. Shout out to all the people over there, um, you know, for letting us use CR3. Big up to the homie Noah40, um, you know what I'm saying? For letting us use CR3 to get those exclusive interviews and look out for those coming real, real soon. Okay, um, I'm done here. That's the top six tracks for the week. So make sure to let us know who you want to be as the number one on this list. So it's your boy Friday Ricky Dread, aka No Academic, signing out. <laughs>